Hey, how's it going, Ava? Thanks for taking the time to watch this video that I made for you. In this video analysis, I'm going to show you exactly how much business and clicks you get to your website um, versus your competitors and show you exactly what it's going to take to dominate the market here in San Diego. Okay. And this whole process is called search engine optimization. All right. Um, really, our target and our goal here is to increase the number of leads and increase your sales overall. Um, that's always been our number one primary focus. Um, yes, more web traffic, you know, more leads, um, more online awareness is great, but it's all about, you know, how much business is it bringing in for your company? And that's what you care about, right? So that's what we're here to do. Um, so as you can see, we're on my business page. My company's AMP Local. We're an internet marketing agency here in um, San Diego. So just visit my website if you'd like to learn more about my company and the services that we offer here at AMP Local. Um, so just want to jump right into the video. So here is your website. So as you may already know, you know, over 90% of the population, when they need a product or service, they're going to use Google. All right, Google is the most powerful, popular way to extract information from the internet. Um, and 96% of these searchers are going to click from the very first page of Google. So if your page is on page two, it might as well be on page 20. All right, it's going to be very, very hard for someone to find your services and want to choose you when they're looking for, you know, custom cabinetry or home remodeling or bathroom remodeling here in San Diego. Um, so it's really all about getting you at the forefront of these searches to drive more sales and more revenue, right? Um, <clears throat> so to find you, there are many ways to find you on the internet. Um, you guys offer uh, custom cabinets, kitchen cabinets, um, you know, kitchen remodeling, bathroom remodeling, uh, uh, home remodeling, um, European designs. So there's so many different things uh, to look for you for so here's all your services so as you already know um, but I'm gonna focus on just some of the very most important profitable keywords okay just to give you a brief overview on keywords um, kitchen cabinets here in San Diego get searched 1600 times you know just the one keyword and overall in San Diego there's around 16 17 thousand 19 thousand times a month someone is trying to you know, get new kitchen cabinets, get custom cabinets made, uh, bathroom cabinets. I mean, look, here's the, um, I can target all of the keywords to rank your company and it shows you exactly how many times you get searched per month. So, you know, around 18,000 times per month. Um, let's, we can just look up uh, kitchen, um, kitchen remodeling. To give you an idea of how many people here in San Diego are looking for that type of service. So, that one gets searched 90, 90 times per month, but again, you know, here we go, 12, 13,000 times a month, someone is trying to do something to their kitchen, whether it be cabinets or designs or remodeling or design ideas, uh, bathroom remodeling ideas. Um, so all these keywords are very, very profitable and can bring tons of revenue to your business if you're, if you're on page one of Google for these, um, these searches, all right? So... First, I'm going to go over the ones that we did not find you in. All right, or it was it was a challenge. It, we found you in, but it was a challenge to find you because you weren't on page one. Um, not so much for this one. Uh, custom cabinets, um, San Diego. You're ranked on page two. All right, and you're right here at uh, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So you're ranked number 16 right here on page two for custom cabinets San Diego which is a very profitable keyword um, if you're on page one you could be pulling some serious leads from this one keyword but um, the rankings holding you back on this one um, here's another one uh, kitchen cabinets uh, San Diego so this one right here um, it's you guys understand have a showroom at this company so they are ranked number two um, so if anyone visiting a site could potentially find you, but again, it's going to be, you want to drive, this is all about driving business and traffic to, uh, your website. Um, so for this one, for kitchen cabinets, I couldn't find, um, your website here at all. I searched through the pages, definitely not on page one. Um, if it's not there, like I said, it might as well be on page 20. Another keyword, uh, kitchen remodeling San Diego. This one's huge. Um. I couldn't find you at all in these searches. Uh, another big one that you would want to be on is um, bathroom remodeling. 
San Diego. And uh, for this one, couldn't find you at all in these searches as well. Um, so I'm just giving an idea, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm hitting the keywords because all these keywords, you know, can bring thousands of new uh, leads to your business every month. Um, so these are some of the most profitable ones. Interior Design San Diego is another great one. Um, so couldn't find you in this one as well. Um, as you may already know, you know, this is the Google Maps right here and this is the organics. Um, so of course the key is to get you at the top of both of these. So let me show you where I did find you. Okay, we did find you for custom cabinets on page two and then we couldn't find you at all on another ones. Um, so for this company cabinets, um, Lechet Cabinets San Diego, if I'm pronouncing that correctly, um, you guys are on like all over this page. It's because you guys offer that very specific service and not many competitors are doing that in San Diego, which is phenomenal. All right. So right here, I can look up exactly which keywords you guys are pulling all your traffic from. So it looks like that one keyword is actually pulling 90%. 91% of your business right there. So the majority of your business is coming from this one keyword, which is phenomenal. Okay, let me show you how much you're getting from that though. You are getting about, this is your website here. This you're getting about seven clicks to your website a month on average. Okay, you got seven this past month, you know, month before that it was two, seven. You did have a couple nice little spikes um, last year, but it looks like business is steadily um, you know, between five and seven or below five. So um, getting your business ranked in these other keywords obviously is going to make it jump way higher than that. Let me give you an example of what that looks like. All right. Um, so here's one of your top competitors, San Diego cabinets.org. All right. This is just cabinetry. Um, so they're getting, you know, around 60 to 50, even 70 new visitors per month. Um, so these guys are obviously getting a lot more business. They're actually, you know, probably getting about seven or eight times more, nine times more business than you right now. Um, so that's the potential. So when we start talking about remodeling kitchens and bathrooms, um, one of your top competitors is, uh, remodelworks.com here in San Diego. So these guys are pulling anywhere between four and five, even 600 clicks to their website per month. All right, so combined, you know, if we dominate and rank uh, these keywords for your business and do SEO for your business with these keywords, you could potentially be pulling, you know, at a minimum 500 new visitors uh, to your website per month, which is going to dramatically boost your sales, which is, you know, like a probably a, a, that's probably looking about a 5,000% increase in, in business. Um, so, which is incredibly huge. Um, so there's huge potential for your business with SEO search engine marketing that I'm showing you here. And, um, I really hope it makes sense. So how do we get you there? I've kind of showed you, you now talked about the keywords that we can rank your company. And I showed you the value of being ranked on the first page for those keywords. I showed you, you know, your competitors and how much traffic they're getting versus you. Um, you know, cause you know, in San Diego, a lot of people, they like I said, they don't know your company, but they know they need cabinets or they need they know they need their bathroom remodel. So that's how they're gonna search, you know, and the top companies that are on the first page are gonna click from. Um so knowing that the process that we follow is gonna get you ranked up there. So how do we do it? Google has an algorithm, all right. So it has two hundred determining factors in this algorithm. All right, I'm not going to talk about all of them, um, but I'm going to talk to you about four of the very most important ones. Okay, once we nail these, everything else kind of falls into place. The first thing I want to talk to you about is being mobile friendly or having a mobile friendly web design. So 60 to 80% of consumers, when they're looking for that product or service, they're going to use their iPhone or Android or mobile device. So you got to look great on a phone and Google takes it very, very seriously. There's a lot of companies that have been penalized and last week, um, Google just updated the algorithm for this. So those companies are dropping off the map pretty much. So for your website, you are mobile friendly. So I did a mobile friendly test here. You guys are good to go. So you don't have to worry about that. All right. The next thing I want to talk to you about is authoritative content. Now this one, very, very important. Uh, what I mean by authoritative content is, are you mentioning all of your services on your homepage? Are you educating the consumer? And are you showing that you are a local business here in San Diego? Um, 
And are you using authoritative keywords? Do you have keyword research built in? So you want to see, Google wants to see at least 1,000 to 2,000 words of content built in with keyword research, uh, educational information, or in everything that has to do about your company services here in San Diego. So right now, the only content as a consumer I see is a very small paragraph here. This is definitely affecting your rankings. This is this is huge for your rankings right here. You want to be mentioned in you know bathroom remodeling, kitchen remodeling, kitchen cabinetry, kitchen cabinets, uh, you know home renovations or uh, any other other services that you provide. We want to build all those keywords. You know a bunch of the profitable keywords that I mentioned earlier, and then all of these keywords that people are actually using to find your services. You want to be mentioning here on your home page this is most important you can have you know a thousand pages on this website and have you know twenty thousand different services and you know a million words of content throughout the page but the home page is the cream of the crop this is what this is the page you want to rank on google this is the very first thing that you want your your uh customers to see and it's it's what google's looking at all right so it has to be taken very seriously so we can definitely build you out um, and write, you know, unique authoritative content with with the keyword research built in that I've demonstrated here, um, and put that on the home page. Uh, and this will dramatically improve your rankings for all those keywords um, more than you could ever know. All right, so that's authoritative content. Just to give you an idea of what that looks like, okay? I put elephant in in, in Google, and I look what's number one, Wikipedia. So just bear with me. So Wikipedia is notorious for popping up number one because of their authoritative content. Look at all the content on this page. All right, there's probably fifty thousand words on the habitat, their evolution, what they eat, where they sleep, everything about elephants. Okay, so just to give you an idea, that's what it looks like. But we're tar we're looking for one thousand to two thousand words, definitely on the home page. Okay. Next, I'm going to talk to you about local listings. We also call these citations. So, um. These are very important. This is how we get our business name uh, listed and out there on the internet. So we have to have our business name, address, and phone number identical because if not, Google's going to slap us down in the rankings. Uh, some examples are Google, obviously, Yahoo, Facebook being yellow pages and white pages. So it looks like your business is primarily listed on the internet in Lemon Grove, California. Okay. So if I did a local search, in Lemon Grove, uh, most likely I should be able to see you in the maps uh, for some of the keywords. But here's the thing that's affecting you. You have a 40% error rate. Okay, So it looks like for Google, your business is listed as um, this company here. All right, And your address is in Kettner Boulevard. Now that's great if you're trying to target for San Diego, but your uh, local listings, all of them have a Lemon Grove address and there's discrepancies in the business name all over the place and you're missing tons and tons of listings. Okay, so this is a major discrepancy. Um, if I punched this address in for Kettner, I'm sure we would get uh, different results here. So if I go in here and I punch this in, it's probably going to give you even more of an error rate because if you are trying to be listed in San Diego versus um, Lemon Grove, you're going to have a lot more errors. So now you have uh, a 92% error rate because now Google's not recognizing the fact that now it wants to think we're, we're searching that you're in San Diego, but you're listed in um, Lemon Grove everywhere. So you kind of see what's going on here. So there's there's a huge uh, discrepancy. Uh, Google's very confused on where you're located because Google is a um, it's all about uh, location you're a brick and mortar um, you want to service a specific area so for them to take you serious and be in the local map listings um, you have to be listed correctly on the internet so we would need to go in find out exactly where your brick and mortar is or find out exactly you know where you guys service out of you know is that Kettner or is that uh, Lemon Grove which one do you prefer and get your business listed with all the correct information. Get the name listed correctly in all of them. Okay, so just to, just to give you an idea, you guys have a lot uh, major discrepancy here with the listing. So um, that that's something definitely that we're going to be able to, to fix for you. So these are the top 50 in the country, okay? You want to be listed in all of these, um, but there's thousands, and we can get you listed in hundreds over time, which is going to you know, really seal the deal when it comes to someone searching for a local San Diego business. You know, 
So fourth thing, let me talk to you about backlinks. We also call these uh, influence pages. So say you have a client thoroughly impressed with your product and services. Um, you know, say they have an article or a blog or a website, what's going to happen is they're going to write an article or mention you on the internet. And Google, anyone reading that article can click to your website. Now you have a new prospect, but most importantly, Google sees this as a vote. So um, Google is all a, is a popularity contest. Uh, it's like running for president. The more votes you have, the more likely you're going to win. Okay, so these are your votes. Uh, so this is saying right now there's 25 websites mentioning you 68 times on the internet. Okay, and what's what's most important here is this trust flow of 15. Let me let me tell you what that is. The trust flow is the quality of these domains. So at a 15, you're meeting medium quality, which is great, but you're not high quality. Um, and this is definitely affecting your organic rankings. Uh, some of your top competitors have very high. Um, trust flows. So what's great about our company is that we have unlimited amounts of backlinks to refer your company to and list you on the internet. So you have all of that uh, powerful backbone and to show Google that you have all these votes. Okay, so we can link your website to all these and they're all 20 and 25 above. They're actually off the charts. All right, so huge potential. Um, so real quick, that kind of concludes um, the analysis portion uh, real quick I want to show you this I didn't get to pull this up earlier but you know when you're ranked number one on the organics you get about 35 percent all the clicks for that one keyword if you're ranked number one in, or in the maps that's about 70 percent so imagine cornering 70 percent of the market for all of these keywords for kitchen remodeling for cat you know custom cabins uh, in San Diego for bathroom remodeling or bathroom cabinets all these keywords um, that we're able to find and target and we're actually able to target your uh, your competitors top keywords just like I found your top keywords we can target your top competitors keywords and take the market from them so there's uh, there's tons of things that we can do uh, you know to really secure your business's future online and really generate more traffic and leads to your business so real quick you know while I have you here I just like to throw in some case study information you know about some of our products that we've had in the past um, I, uh, I think that's really important for you to kind of see what what we can do uh, one of our clients is uh, San Diego uh, auto connection they're you know big auto used auto dealer here in San Diego and Mission Valley and uh, when we took them on you know about four months ago they were like on page four three and four you couldn't find them on the internet now for for a lot of major keywords you know like San Diego auto dealers when someone's looking for an auto dealer in their area um, they're right here number three ranked in the maps and number one organically and they're pulling in huge tons of traffic they're pulling in about you know 23 2600 leads per month to their website which is huge um, and before you know you couldn't hardly find them so um, Another company that we started working with, we also do lead generation websites. So we build out um, custom websites here in uh, San Diego and rank them in uh, for any niche market. Um, so we built out a lead generation website in Escondido for a limousine party bus company in San Diego, downtown San Diego. And we ranked it in Escondido within two weeks. It's ranked number two. We've had this for a few months now. It's ranked number two right now. Um, and it's dominating the local market for party bus and limousines in, in Escondido. And they're pulling in huge amount of leads. And just to give you exactly, you know, an idea of how much business this website's pulling, um, this is a call report. Um, you know, with these lead generation websites, we're able to do uh, call tracking with our uh, phone software. And um, they're getting, in the past 90 days, they've gotten almost 600 phone calls for party bus or limo and it's increasing because the website rankings increasing we've also ranked this website um, in La Jolla and, and multiple uh, a few other areas as well you know so there's huge potential lead generation this, this doesn't include the email request um, you know so in the past 90 days they've gotten over 300 email requests so they've gotten over 900 leads in the past 90 days which is phenomenal for their company um, so they're very grateful for us obviously um, so that, that's just a couple of quick um, case studies I wanted to show you. Um, you know, uh, I think it, transparency is very important. 
you know, you're looking for a company that you're going to invest in um, and you definitely want them to be investing 10x into you and make sure that you guys are driving sales and getting more revenue. All right. So um, I really hope that everything made sense that I presented to you in this video. Um, you know, we're really grateful and very passionate about the work that we do and we're able to help local businesses here in San Diego grow. Um, so if you are interested in more leads, you are interested in more sales, um, please reach back out to me and give me a call. Um, you know, and I, I love to put something together and we can even meet. Um, but um, that's going to be the very, very next step. So again, I appreciate the time that you took to watch this. You have my information. Uh, please reach back out and we'll, I'd love to hear from you. Thanks again for your time. Have a great day.